the fast food podcast. podcast. Can we quickly talk about uh, the writer strike. Yeah. Um, so May eleven thousand five hundred TV and film writers went on strike, mm-hmm. and obviously the dispute is between obviously is 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 part of because of the streaming services that's happening now, um, where the old model of network TV is diminishing um, in terms of the writers and how they get paid how they get paid mm-hmm. so obviously the older model is the AB, the ABC NBC CBS where um, there was about 80 shows a year on average produced um, and fill and shot and and the writers used to work uh, between September and the, the the episodes would release about September and finish around May the next year mm-hmm. so obviously the writers had about you know, a good 22, 23 episodes mm-hmm. and would be paid per episode every week yeah. and would be paid a certain price. Now, obviously, compared to what's happening with streaming is a whole different model Yeah, because um, the advertising has changed. Mm-hmm. So I, when I was listening, when I was trying to understand it, 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 I was watching something on YouTube where they were talking about the fact that with the old model you used to have about five or six episodes, five or six adverts every hour. And what the writers would do is leading up to the, to the advert, they would design the writing so that the the ending act would draw you in to come back after the commercial break. Right. And they would design the episodes like that, which, which makes sense. Yeah. Um, But where you've got streaming, there's no adverts. So now that whole thing has changed. And then, they um, they were talking about the fact that most of the writers would work off a 40-week period with the old model of network 40 TV. 40-hour. 40-week. Oh, 40 weeks. They would oh, work 40 weeks, sorry, would so, yeah, 40 yeah, yeah, weeks yeah, 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 yeah. where with streaming, it's cough. Yeah. So now, you've if you're a writer, you can't just rely on that job. You've got to find other mm-hmm. jobs yeah. as well to work on. Yeah. Which, which is making it more difficult. Yeah, the 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 misconstruing part about all this because now the actors have joined. So this is the first time since the nineteen sixties that this has happened. Yeah, where the actors and the writers have strike together. Yeah. Um, the thing is, some people are getting it confused, and they're like, "Oh, the actors are striking because they want more pay." But there's certain actors who won't get out of bed or won't have a conversation about starring in or leading a a, a role in a film. Sorry for less than a certain amount. Like their going yeah, rate yeah, is yeah. 10 mil and up. Yeah, yeah. Minimum is 10 mil. And they might take less than 10 mil and they might take a little eight or 7.5 mil, but they're getting two or three points on the back end of the film, which, which means yours. that whatever it makes, so if a film makes, uh, I don't know, 500 mil in the box office globally, they'll get some points off of that. So they'll essentially recoup yeah. the cut pay cut they took in order to sign onto the film. So if, right, you're in, right. if you're like a Robert Downey Jr. Yeah. when you was... Iron Man in the first Iron Man if, you, if Marvel offered you because at that time he wasn't who he is today he's always been a dope actor but his his uh, cachet wasn't as high as it is now yeah but if they said to him alright we'll offer you 7 mil and he goes nah I'll take 4.5 but give me 3 points off of every Iron Man film that I'm in or I appear in he's making bank because the more he, films he's been in the more money those films are making he's making bank so yeah. that 7.5 he took or 4.5, sorry, he's probably made quadruple that just off the back end because yeah. he's making it off of how much it's made total box office as well as DVD sales, merch, whatever, whatever. Yeah. Anyway, but what it really is about is that people are not getting the benefits out of something that is being televised in multiple countries. Right. If you write in a show and it premieres in the US of A, cool. You're getting paid for that. But then a streamer a la a Netflix or Disney Plus or uh, a Prime or um, who's the other one? A Paramount, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah, Hulu. They're, they're going to, right, they're, who's owned by Disney. They're yeah. going to then take that product, they'll pay for the rights to that product, and then it's on their streaming platform. Now, their streaming platform is being accessed by people all over the world. But you're not getting, you're not seeing the benefit of that. Yeah. Like, if every household this thing is in, you're getting a pound from it, yeah? You're laughing. Yeah. But the residuals do not amount to how much 
money these these streaming shows are making for the streamer. And Netflix are trying to thing where they're trying different tiers to get people to sign up and there might be adverts. You can have ads on the streaming platform. It's just the type of ads. And Netflix lose yeah. money because they'll have like a, a rocket show like Stranger Things, but there's no advertising money coming in. So even though it's the most talked about show in yeah, the world, yeah, there's no adverts popping into the yeah, episodes yeah. where Netflix can go, well, look, if you mm. want to advert on Stranger Things, you got to pay us two mil or you got to pay us this amount. So they're taking an L. They're taking it. Yeah, Netflix have been hemorrhaging money, but like, are they you in know, a, are they in a, are they in a, are they in a red? Netflix or they they, they, they they're like in a red, but it always just seems to this Netflix they have a few shooters in the can in it like Stranger Things, um, Squid <clears> Games, <throat> uh, um, what's that one with the Royals and that? Um, yeah, I know what you're talking um, about uh, Bridgerton. Yeah. They have all those type of shows, so they 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 and they're Netflix original, so it's like cool, but they spend a lot with little return. Like they'll spend to get the Rock, Gal Gadot, and Ryan Reynolds in a film. But then it's like they are banking on the name. But then you're not making a, a film that's like good. You're not making a good film where it's like you can go put it in the cinema and recoup some of that money. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? I think I think that what the writers are saying is they just want stability. They, they want, want stability, stability and they want, you know, they want to they get want a pay, certain part yeah. of the pie that, you know, that covers their healthcare. Because obviously in America, healthcare ain't free. They need to so eat, they want man. like and pay them rent. Some people are living check by check. So imagine you're on a show that you're living check by check on as a writer and then the show just halts because nah, there's a writer strike and an actor strike. If you're earning enough to, to cover you, it's a 10 episode thing and it's covering you for 10, ep- 10 months in a year and that's on, on a halt. What are you going to do? So what's this unit? What's this union that, that all the writers have joined? Some union now? What, SAG, the SAG. Yeah, the SAG thing. Uh, the WGA, which is, I think this WGA right guild I of America. I think that's a good thing. I think that's good, man. If they, if they can, basically, if they're all taking a stance... Something's got to give at some point. But the wickedest thing is animators, animation creators, don't have a union. Right. So all this is going on, they have to just keep working. What's this about this AI shit now where they can use AI now to, to, to take your likeness? You know, that, you know after Love Island, yeah, there's a show that comes on where they've like taken a likeness of a person's face. That's deep fake. Yeah. That's deep fake. Yeah, but that's been around for Are you allowed to do that though? Well, how do you, how do you, like, you got Kim Kardashian's face, you got, yeah. you got. I don't know how it works, because obviously does it, it's like, you're yeah. using someone's likeness in some fuckery shit, because a lot of the time it's just dissing them, right? And, or making them say shit that, the, you know. Um, I don't know, but the it's, AI thing loop, is. There's a loophole in that, then. The AI thing is, first of all, people are concerned AI might write scripts. But the thing with AI is, it's, it's, because chat G, uh, what's it called? Chat. It's yeah, GPT. GBT. That's been up in some little, uh, you know, passer passer because apparently it's not creating stuff off the whim. It's pulling stuff from the internet from other places. Right. And there's a word for that where you're, is it plagiarism, I think? Where you're, yeah, you're, yeah, you're yeah. using someone else's work as yeah, your yeah. teeth in. So basically, te- yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I'm trying to be all <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. PC up and then they're teeth and shit from <laughs> yeah, the web yeah, yeah. and trying to say, oh, yeah, look, we create this thing for you. Yeah. Um, see, there's that. I don't think AI can ever write a script. Better than a person. A person can. Writers in a writer's room writing a script. I don't think AI yeah, can ever do that. But then there's also the thing where if you're an extra in a film and an extra is basically someone who's in the background just walking by or pretending they're, oh my gosh, just screaming, there's a, 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 a flipping, you know, world event happening or whatever. Apparently they're saying, like, look, they want to scan your face and all that. Yeah, bro. Before you come on set. And then there's the thing where it's like they can make multiple, you know, Versions. so effectively. You've seen Pulp Fiction. They don't need you. You've seen Pulp Fiction, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good movie. You know that thing with Mar- You know that scene with Marcellus Wallace? You know the scene. Oh, yeah, when he's getting beaten. Right. Yeah, the media have to go in detail. Let me ask a, it's a proper random question. But you see when you walk in the street, yeah? Yeah. You think every person you walk past is a real person? Oh, don't do that. <laughs> don't, do, don't do that. I was like, man's on the plane with the woman. Yeah. But yeah, they, uh, they, with the AI stuff, they could use your face and basically put your face. So you could it's be, like you could have been Marcellus Wallace in that scene. Yeah. Because they you scanned your face. They yeah. could just replace Ving Rhames' face and use your face in that scene. And without keep it, you and keep it moving. Keep it moving. And you can't say shit because you gave them consent to to scan your face and now they can use it as they want. So yeah, it's a definitely a watershed moment. Like 
Hollywood is shut down. It's not even a joke. Yeah. Nothing. Actors can't promote their movies. Nothing's moving, man. Only directors can promote the movies. Actors can't promote their movies. So that Barbie film that's out now that's just taking everyone's money. They luckily they did a warrior promotion before, before yeah. the strike happened. But no actors, as part of solidarity for what's going on, no actors can promote any films they're in. Hopefully it's uh, I feel like I think that's a good thing because this is what needs to happen across the world. But this happens. Needs it needs to happen, to happen in, in like music. Music. It needs to happen in like just day-to-day stuff. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah. just strike against yeah. cost of living and shit like that. Like One, two. Yo, yeah, 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 yeah. Now we come to the payoff. Now we come to the payoff. Mike, check, check, check. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. System. Ah. Uh, uh. Food is a metaphor for information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yo, get your head around this The concept, two men about this uh, Trissy sack effect, freckles, respect rebels We'll take the stairs, you stay there It's next level, put up the frame They couldn't see the vision I'll take the blame when it comes to fruition From four to three and then we lost one I won't cause a scene cause camera's on sun It's a you look up, understand. You're in the dark with the sharks, it's a blood bath. We got the mics, it's a fire, had a tough star. Now I've got the stripes, it's in sight, it's all love calm. Morgan Heights, it's food for the mind. A feast for the palate, you can eat the design. Serial killer with a splash of cold milk, these men are built. A weight, lactic acid, hold skills. Yo, give me the space, we need the mic. You know the vibes, you know the vibes. Camera action, lights. We do what we do, we say what we like. Uh, it's the FFE. It's the FFE. It's the FFE. It's the FFE.